Hey y'all, I'm out here hiking off trail, having a good outdoors day, and I kind of realized right now I'm in prime snake habitat. I'm hoping this is coming through. There's a lot of grass, a lot of greenery, just the kind of place these guys really like to hang out at. And it got me thinking about some of the videos that I see, or more importantly, don't see. Lots of things about bow drills, uh, ferro rods, all kinds of fancy stuff. Not too much on the basics. So, why do people get bitten by snakes? There's two main reasons. One, people find a poisonous snake, they gotta play with it. Be a big shot, be cool, and they get bit. The other is what we're looking at right here. You see this log laying on the ground? Now, and I've seen people doing this so much even in YouTube videos walking through and stepping over a log like this from one side to the other. What's going to happen if there's a snake on the back side of that log, you just got bit. Especially if you step on them, but all you got to do is startle them and you got bit. So what you got to do the way that you cross something like that is step on it first, look over. Look over to the back side, make sure there's nothing there. It's I know it's really basic stuff guys, but for people you know from say Chicago who've never ever been in the woods they don't know this stuff so anyway I hope someone out there can see this and remember it and one day avoid getting that snake bite alright thanks for watching guys and have a good day